Hi, John DeWire here uh, from theinstitutewow.com and uh, it's getting towards the end of Friday and I had not put a Facebook Live post up and I was getting withdrawal symptoms and uh, uh, let me say to you, if you're in business and you haven't tasted or tested this Facebook Live stuff, you ought to get onto it. You should get onto it. It's quite crazy in terms of the potential business that it brings for your uh, company. Um, if you are going to do Facebook Live, and I absolutely recommend that if you're a business owner you should be considering this, then what you do uh, need to consider is that it has to have three uh, components for it to work for you in terms of making your money. Number one, you've got to give good content, and I will give you some good content, I promise, in just a moment after you've heard my rant. Uh, number two, you've got to build rapport, which means you ask people to comment below or to send a like, and you can do that right now <laughs> if you don't mind, give me a like. Um, and number three, you've got to make offers. You know, you can't sell anything if you don't make an offer. You can imagine that if you walked into a car dealership and all the car salesmen just stood there and never walked up and said anything to you, that's pretty unlikely you're going to buy a car. Uh, so, good content, good rapport, or building a relationship, and then number three, uh, make an offer. Uh, and the reason I decided I'd do this one, <clears throat> uh, if you're a business owner, you're probably uh, familiar with the uh, fact that uh, uh, thanks, Michael. How are you, mate? Um, you're probably familiar with the fact that uh, most businesses don't have a marketing plan. Can you believe it? I had a call with a business today. Uh, this business is doing $3.4 million turnover and sales have flatlined. Sales have flatlined, all right? And uh, they were bitching and moaning to me that sales are flatlined. And I said to them, oh, okay, so what, what were you doing online? What Facebook ads are you doing or uh, Instagram or, you know, what direct mail letters are you doing? How are you milking your database? And there was silence in the background. You could hear a pin drop. And uh, they were in a boardroom. There was three of them. And uh, we're talking about a three-point-plus million-dollar business. No marketing plan. They had built their business just on uh, referrals. And it's great, I get lots of referrals too, but I don't know when they're going to come. I might get five this week, I might get a zip next week. I can't exactly put food on the table based on whether or not I'm gonna get referrals this week. So what you want for your business, if you're a business owner, is a predictive marketing model. You want a marketing plan. I don't know why I'm sounding like Seinfeld, but <laughs> you want a marketing plan. I'm not quite sounding like Seinfeld. Um, and I thought I'd give you the opportunity to just swipe a uh, 100 plus marketing plans. How's that for a a bribe. How's that for a, like a, a bribe? Um, and of course you know a sell's coming, um, but before I do the sell, uh, which uh, by the way is uh, to my uh, website at wowmarketingacademy.com.au, is it .au? Yeah, I'm just looking at it on my computer screen. You'd think I'd get that right, wouldn't you? I don't even know my middle name, by the way. Yes, I do. Do you know what my parents named me? John Francis Dwyer. Like, can you imagine going to a Catholic school uh, in primary when the St. Joseph's nuns would go through that roll call of the daytime and there'd be, you know, Tim, uh, Fred Smith, and there'd be uh, George, you know, Stephen Wilson, and she'd say to me, what's your name? And I'd go, John DeWire. She'd go, no, 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 your middle name, John Francis DeWire. No, no, can you, can you say your middle name louder? Because it, nuns were evil back in those days, of course. And I'd have to say John Francis DeWire, and then everyone in the class would turn around and laugh at me. And at the moment, I hope you're going, Oh, you're probably not. But anyway, so therefore the thing is, is that, uh, yeah, so I, I purposely forget my middle name. So that's why I want to look up to the screen. The actual website that you should go to, and uh, if anyone could just help me out here, because Dickhead Me did not put it under the headline. I should put a link under the headline. If someone could type in www, you've got to put the www in for a link to work, uh, wowmarketingacademy.com.au. So that's wowmarketingacademy.com.au. If you put that in, I promise I'll come around and mow your lawns for you on the weekend, uh, if you don't mind. Preferably, if that's the case, you will be in a gated community like Sanctuary Cove, so therefore I'm mowing a rich person's lawn. Now, let me tell you about the uh, marketing plans and how you can get your, whole, your hand on them. I've got a big book, and, in, and that is an electronic program as well. And uh, in this gigantic uh, book, there are lots and 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 lots of marketing plans. And I've got a smaller version of that book, whilst I'm in the mood to show off. And I thought I'd show you, I know you're seeing it backwards, I understand that you're seeing it backwards, but the fact that, oh, thank you very much, Michael, it's very nice of you to do that, mate. Uh, I know you're seeing this backwards, okay, but let me just flip this over, and uh, you're seeing it backwards like that. Uh, but the fact is, is that these are the sorts of marketing plans that I put together for a lot, a lot of businesses. That one there, what is that? You're seeing it backwards, but it's a holidays business for seniors, uh, which I might do a contra with him. <laughs> you know what, I... 
I can see myself in that walking frame, I really can. Um, uh, yes, so therefore you'll see here, these marketing plans are broken up. This one here is for a pharmacy. I know you're seeing it backwards, so stop shaking your head. Uh, but we give in these marketing plans a very, very comprehensive, this is office supplies, so it's something like office works. You'll see that there's layouts for websites in there, there's layouts for Facebook ads. We go through showing people what they should be doing online and offline. Uh, and so on and so forth. We have a hundred plus marketing plans in a particular website, which Michael's been kind enough to give you the link for. And uh, you can get into that if you just pay me lots of money. <laughs> Not lots of money, just a little bit of money. Um, and let me tell you, before I go on and rave about what's in that, let me tell you why a marketing plan is important. Do you know that the statistics from the Australian Bureau of Statistics is that 50% of Australian businesses will go broke within three years of launching. So for all the businesses that are opening in Australia this year, 50% uh, of them will be gone within three years. Now, I don't think that's because they've got bad products or bad service, sometimes it might be, but most of the time is they're driving in the dark without headlights. They don't have a marketing plan because they haven't invested the money in someone like me or someone else to put a marketing plan together for them. So when the shit hits the fan and all of a sudden they lose a few clients or if they were selling to the retail sector, David Jones decided to stop stocking their product or whatever it may be, they're in deep you know what. And normally what happens is that those businesses sit down at the dinner table and go, shit, what are we going to do? And you know what they normally do? They drop their pants. They drop their pants and reduce prices and uh, basically lose margin and turn cash around so at least they've got some money coming in, but they've lost margin, they've lost profit, and they are suffering from what I would call dickhead-itis. You have to have a marketing plan. And for goodness sake, if you need a marketing plan, be very careful about getting someone under 25 to put it together because you're gonna get someone out of uni that says, you know what, I've got this little bit of paper here, a uh, little bit bigger than that, <laughs> this little bit of paper here, which is a certificate that I've got an advertising degree, and you go, well, congratulations, you're also still using Proactive. If you want a marketing plan put together that's going to be a sensible, cost-effective one for your business, you need someone with a few of these wrinkles that has been around the block a few times and understands customer uh, attraction uh, concepts. And you don't want a marketing plan that's only going to be telling you, oh, well, I think you should sponsor the Brisbane Broncos or St. George, because if someone sees your logo on the back of a football jersey, of course they will give you their business, of course they will. And you know what you ought to do? Put an ad on the side of a bus. Get your name out there. Bullshit. That is just ridiculous crap, and I see it happening all the time. You don't worry about getting your name out there because you're not McDonald's. If you're watching this right now, I doubt very much whether I've got the CEO of the Commonwealth Bank or Kellogg's or Toyota or McDonald's watching this. There's every chance in the world, if you're a business owner, you're probably doing 100 or 200 or 400 or $500,000 a year or a million or two or five or 10, but you're certainly not McDonald's. I don't think McDonald's CEO will be watching this, okay? Now, the thing, if he was, I'd be saying to him, wake up to himself because he's got 1.7 million people going through his restaurants today and he has no clue who they are. So therefore, Mr. McDonald's, CEO, if you are watching this, wake up to yourself. When you give those people that little receipt, when they're waiting there, supposedly for you to you know, make the hamburger fresh, you've got about two minutes, you could be getting them to write their name and details in there to win a trip to Disneyland or something, and you'd be collecting some data of those 1.7 million people that are going through your restaurants today, and you're letting their names slip through your fingers. Crazy stuff. Did, did, did I just get off the subject? I did, yeah, I'm sorry. So therefore, let me get back to the marketing plan. When you put a marketing plan together and you'll see, I'll show you a sample in a minute of how you can get it, um, you need to be concentrating offline and online if you are a bricks and mortar business. And if you're just an online business, of course, you should be concentrating just online. And it should cater for Facebook, it should cater for Instagram and LinkedIn and basically all the online platforms that are the major traffic sources. And let me show you how you can get your hands on it. I'm gonna flip my camera around here. This will be a blatant plug, but what the heck, you're watching this for free, all right? I have got the WOW Marketing Academy, and that is there in my little 60 minutes pose form. And you can join this WOW Marketing Academy at the moment for a crazy price of $497 a month, uh, which I think is pretty stunning, okay, for what you get. And let me show you what you get as I scroll down here. You'll see it's normally around about uh, 14 97 okay, a month. And uh, what we're doing is uh, making it available for a special Facebook Live deal uh, at $497 a month if you use a promo code, and that promo code is WOWME, okay? Five letters, W-O-W-M-E, WOWME. Let me show you what you get in this, okay? You get uh, entry into WOW Central, which is the largest marketing ideas library on the planet. Uh, essentially, you, when you get in there, everything that I've done that has worked over the last five or 10 years, I've put into this online library. So whatever business you're in, if you're a butcher, baker, candlestick maker, you just type in your industry and up will come 
dozens and dozens and dozens and dozens of samples. The reason I've got all those faces there is that I've looked after just about every industry you could possibly think of in putting together marketing plans. And as you can see on the screen there, if I just read out a few of them, air conditioning, plumbing, accountancies, landscapers, kitchen renovations, agriculture, music teaching, pest control, mechanics, dog grooming, for God's sake. <laughs> dog grooming. I think I told them to go away, they were boring with shitless. But anyway, newspapers, radio, hotel, photography, travel, wineries, turf farms, tree surgeries, wedding, you name it, I've looked after it, okay? And as we go down the page, this is the big one, marketing plans, okay? So therefore, you're going to find a, is it plethora? Is that the word? I'll ask someone in my office. Plethora? Okay, you're going to find a plethora, whatever the hell that means, of marketing plans. I think it means shitloads. I looked up, hang on, I'm just looking up the thesaurus on my other, I can't even say that, the <laughs> dictionary on my other computer, and plethora means shitload. Okay, so you will get a shitload of marketing plans across all sorts of industries that you can just pinch, swipe the ideas, and use. Okay, you'll see me in that freeze frame there on the video holding one up and when you go to that page which Michael McDonald has been kind enough to type in wowmarketingacademy.com.au you'll see that video me showing off about all the wonderful things in there and then you'll also get this okay offline and online customer attraction marketing system and what this is all about is essentially the 12 ingredients that you need to put into a marketing plan to make uh, hopefully a bucket of money to attract people I won't bore you with the whole details of that but there's a bucket load of ideas in there and then what you will get okay uh, by the way that's that's it there so you'll see there uh, we have chapters in this particular module uh, how to determine your most profitable client and look for more people how to be the expert like Gordon Ramsay how to create a wow which is a happy meal toy to take your eyes off the price how to use the problem solution for all you know, how to be actually to build a website that works for God's sake because most of the website there websites are really ugly uh, we'll teach you in this program here how you can out of the Philippines get a website and just pay $97 a month can you believe that so forget about paying five grand six grand ten grand for a website we have a partner now in the Philippines that will build the website for you a six page website and charge you $97 a month is that stupid or stupid okay and so on and so forth so all of these components here add up to showing you number 12 can you see that there how to create a marketing plan now, also what you get is a webinar every two weeks, so you can put up with this sarcasm and really, really funny dad jokes every fortnight, and that happens every Thursday fortnight. And then after that, what we do is we, uh, oh, sorry, before we get to that, we have a closed group Facebook club. So that means that you can ask us questions at any time uh, about anything, particularly relationship problems. If you're having a problem with your wife or husband, we'd love to hear those. I'm joking, all right. Uh, anything to do with advertising or marketing or products or services, you've got a marketing department on tap so when you're in our world for a lousy $497 a month, you are going to be able to ask questions whenever you like because you will be part of our VIP Facebook group, okay? And then what we do is this. This is where you get contact with me every fortnight. We have a live Zoom brain score. Bra brain score. <laughs> it's Friday afternoon. I need a beer. So therefore, this is a live. Let me just bring that up again, okay? So you can see it because I can see it, but you can't. Let me give me one second. Uh, okay, okay. I wish I could drive a car. Okay, so live Zoom brainstorm call with me every fortnight. And uh, that is where you just ask me whatever questions you like about your Facebook advertising or your brochures, your letterbox drops are not working you've been doing some TV ads and no one's watching them, uh, Instagram, whatever it may be, and uh, you'll find that uh, most of the time I've got a pretty decent answer because I, I know everything, okay? And one of my greatest assets, by the way, is my humility. Uh, and, of course, you get invited to three big events throughout the year that we have on the Gold Coast. If you can't make it, don't worry. You can watch, as you can see over here, you can watch via Facebook Live if you can't make it. But if you can make it uh, on a Friday and a Saturday of these events, and you can see the dates there on the screen, May, August, and November, uh, they're action-packed because what I do is bring in all of my experts, well, not all of them, but I bring a whole bunch of experts in that might be website designers, they might be copywriters, they might be customer service experts. Uh, from time to time, we have a very good friend of mine who ran Disney Resorts in Orlando for about oh, 10 years, and he comes in either via uh, Skype uh, from overseas or he's there personally, he likes coming down to Australia, and he teaches you how to run your business like Disney. Uh, so these events alone are probably worth a couple of grand a head. I mean, I've seen people for a two-day event jam-packed with experts like this, particularly in the online world, charge two grand an event. We've got three of them, and you get that free as part of the uh, inclusions that come with the marketing, uh, sorry, the Wow Marketing Academy. And uh, also, uh, that's about it. Okay, you get nothing else. Okay, so you get nothing else. I, I should have got something here, shouldn't I? You get nothing else. Okay. We might throw in, if you're very lucky, a Mars bar. Uh, and if you act within the next one hour, we'll give you two Mars bars. Uh, so look, 
do yourself a favour, go and have a look at it. Um, you can spend a good 10, 15 minutes on that site just having a look at all the stuff that we've got in the WOW Marketing Academy program. It is normally uh, $1,500 or 1497 uh, per month and what we're doing is putting a special deal on at the moment, a Facebook Live deal. Um, I should really screw with your head and say, this is a special LinkedIn deal. And then you go, hang on, oh, I thought I was on Facebook. <laughs> but that would be good, wouldn't it? You can tell I need a beer. Uh, and you can tell I've got the attention span of a millennial because I'm going backwards and forward. Uh, I'll leave it at that. Uh, it's getting towards beer o'clock. Uh, uh, can I just say to you, though, is that if you are going to be putting a marketing plan together, uh, make sure it's a marketing plan with measurability. And that's why I've put this whole, you know, WOW Marketing Academy together because I saw that businesses, particularly those that are doing south of half a million, uh, we have a private coaching program where people who are doing half a million or more, they generally see that as probably a, a better investment because they get me uh, unlimited, okay? And that's a few grand a month, but it's called the, uh, the WOW Masterclass, and I put together a marketing plan customised to their business so they don't have to pinch one that's in the academy program I've just shown you. And what they do is that they basically have access to me whenever, 24-7. They can ask me any questions at any time. Now, people aren't stupid. I might get two or three calls from the one client one week and then I don't hear from them for a week or two whilst they're out implementing stuff. But the fact is, is that they've got an instant marketing department. When they pay a few grand, they come across and basically you know, milk the daylights out of what's between my ears if they want. And uh, I put a customised marketing plan together for them within 10 days, within 10 working days of meeting them in the first place. So uh, if you think about what you pay a secretary these days, the average PA is 54000 in Australia. If you get me as your marketing manager or quasi-marketing manager for 12 times 3, 36 grand, I think I know which one you'd get the better ROI. Uh, yes, patting myself on the back, but uh, I've got some reasonable runs on the board to actually support that uh, boastfulness. So if you're a business doing half a million, a million, two million, three million or more, then you'd find me as a private coaching mentor is probably going to be a better investment. But if you're a startup business or you're a small business doing two or three hundred or four hundred or whatever it might be, thousand, and you don't have the money to, you know, put a few grand a month away, this is an incredible opportunity. Uh, the wow, well, sorry, wowmarketingacademy.com.au. Michael, type that in, so thank you very much. I'm out of here, guys. Uh, I just thought I'd highlight to you on a Friday afternoon, if you don't have a marketing plan, then I cannot feel sorry for you because, you know, at the end of the day, if I said to you, do you think that the most important thing in business is uh, having marketing and sales skills, you'd probably say yes, you'd put your hand up. And in fact, every time I run a seminar, I say to the 100 people in the room, who thinks that having sales and marketing skills is the most important thing in business? They all put their hand up, logically, of course, because if you don't know how to sell, you've got no business. Uh, and then I say, okay, well, let me ask you another question. Who's got a solicitor? They all put their hand up. Uh, and then I'll say to them, okay, well, who's got an accountant? And they all put their hand up. I said, okay, well, 30 seconds ago, you just told me that having sales and marketing skills is the most important thing in business, because if you don't have any sales, you won't need an accountant or solicitor. Uh, who's got anyone you know, in the room advising them about marketing? You can hear a pin drop. You can hear the crickets in the background. Isn't it nuts that we all go into business, we have an accountant, we have a solicitor, we've got an office, we've got a telephone, a computer, everything else, but we know sweet FA about marketing, the most important damn thing. I'm telling you, the butcher that has a sausage sizzle outside his butcher shop and hands out samples of the daytime uh, will always be the butcher across the road who's got his door closed to keep the air conditioning in and doesn't give out any samples. It's all about the marketing. And uh, I've got a sign on my wall here, which, where is it? Uh, it's over there, I won't bother turning the camera around. Uh, it's a messy part of my office, I don't want you to see that. Um, the thing is, is that, it, and my, I've got 104 staff there at the moment. Settle down, settle down all you people. It's Friday afternoon, I'm on one of the, yeah. That's a trouble when you have 100 or more staff. Um, so therefore the sign says, uh, the marketing of what you do is 100 times more important than what you do. Okay, and that is so true. Think about Gordon Ramsay. It's the marketing of what he does, which is a hundred times more important than the fact that he's a good chef. It's the marketing of, write that down now, please, for goodness sake, if you don't, uh, I know your IP address now that you popped on here. I will come around and graffiti your house if you don't do this. Get one of these pens out and write it down now. In fact, put in the comment box below, JD, I have written it down. It's the marketing of what you do is a hundred times more valuable than what you do, okay? Uh, now, if you're solving the world hunger problem, maybe that's not, <laughs> maybe that's not quite so relevant. Okay, I can see Mother Teresa on here now going, "Excuse me, excuse me." 
Uh, so look, uh, I'm joking. Okay, it's Friday afternoon, it's sports day, I can afford to be silly. Uh, so therefore, look, if you've got a business and it is flatlining and you're thinking, shit, what the hell do I do? Uh, I know what we'll do, we'll just drop our pants and sell shit for you know, half price. Well, stop it. You're suffering from severe decaditis, okay? What you need to do is to go to the link that's been typed below very kindly by Michael. Uh, and it's wowmarketingacademy.com.au and if you go there you'll see a special deal at the moment if you type in the code. If you don't type in the code you won't get the special deal and that is called a coupon code and when you go there because we're Americans you can tell that I'm, I've got an American accent, very strong southern drawl. Uh, you all come back now, you hear? Uh, that was Asian. <laughs> I don't know what the hell that was. Um, so therefore, uh, if you go there to wowacademy.com.au, you'll see that when you get to the order page, it says coupon, apply. So just type in there, wow me, W-O-W me. So it's W-O-W-M-E, wow me, and just press apply, and you'll get the special price of $4.97 a month. If you don't do that, uh, then you'll give me three times that. I'll be happy about that. Um, and uh, look, Get a marketing plan. Even if you don't take up my offer, my special Facebook Live offer, if you don't take that up, uh, well, I hope you die in your sleep, basically. <laughs> but aside from that, if you don't take that up, get someone else. Get someone else, except the 21-year-old, okay, who's just come out of uni who says, oh, I've got a marketing certificate. Uh, get someone else with a little bit of vintage and get them to put a marketing plan together for you. But if you've got a business and you don't have a marketing plan, you are nuts, you're crazy. Okay, after insulting you for about seven or eight times, I'm out of here, uh, and uh, hopefully you've enjoyed this. If you did enjoy, could you just type below, JD, I enjoyed the rant, because it was a rant, okay, and uh, JD, can you give me some more about, oh, but tell you what you can do, because I do a lot of these things these days, and why do I do it? Sampling, and it's paying dividends, because we are getting good business from it. Um, then. The fact is, is that if you want to ask me some questions so I can answer those questions for you, I can even email you back if you give me your email address. Anything to do with your business, JD, I've got a, you know, a veterinarian business and uh, I've got a Chinese restaurant's not working and what went wrong. You can ask me any questions like that and if you were kind enough to give me your email address below, uh, I promise I'll get back to you. Might be a year or two, but I will get back to you, okay? And uh, if you like this, then like it. And if you have a business owner friend, then you might like to share it. And if you share it, then what happens is that Facebook then recognises I'm engaging, of course I am, uh, and they will then put my Facebook Live out to more people. You see how this works? If you get to engage people on these Facebook Live things, the algorithm kicks in and says, wow, you're engaging because they've liked you and they've sent some emojis and they've commented. I think what we'll do, Mr. Johnny Carson, is we'll throw your video out to more people because as Facebook, we don't want anyone to watch TV. We don't want anyone to read newspapers or listen to radio. What we want is for them to stay on the platform longer. And if you're keeping them on longer because you've got engagement, we're going to reward you for it. And guess what happens? When Facebook sends my video out to more people, more people see it, more people go to wowmarketingacademy.com, I make some more money, uh, and then I buy mansions and Maseratis and things like that, and then I forget that you exist. That's the way the world should be. I'm joking, okay? I'm out of here. Uh, oh, by the way, if you do go to wowmarketingacademy.com.au and you like what you see there, but you're not quite sure, well, I want to ask some more questions, then simply go then to bookawowcall.com. I hope you're writing this down. I'll be very disappointed if you don't. And if Simon's watching, he might even put that in there. You can go to www.wow, sorry, www.bookawowcall.com and you can speak to one of our guys, Simon or Emil, and they will run you through any questions or answer any questions you have about the Academy program. So that is bookawowcall.com. There's no AU at the end of that, okay? And Simon and Emil, who are my implementation coaches, they will be uh, happy to get back to you on a phone call. There's a little calendar thing there where you can book whatever time suits you. And they won't even insult you, okay? They're really, really nice guys. So if you were unlucky enough to cop me, there's every chance in the world I'll look at your website and tell you to go and jump off a cliff. Uh, but they are not sarcastic like me, they are nice, so it's better that you talk to Simon or Emil. I'm out of here guys, go and have a Friday afternoon drink and uh, have a good weekend, all the best.